Hello everybody, welcome back to Stoneheart Me Banto. So today we're gonna continue with our hard mode town and I wanna do this tower that we are building up here. So that's gonna be a guard tower of our place and that's what we're gonna continue with today. So we do have a door here, we want to enter here and uh, also wanna be able to get up here. So the stairs going up at this side. So we do something like that, so they can actually get up here to the second floor for this. Get the daily update, let's see who joins us guys. Stefan Bendel has joined us, and let's check him out. He got a good mind, a decent body, and not so good of a spirit. And this guy is courageous, and I'm gonna name this from one of you guys, so this is gonna be Dragon Slayer. So you wanted to be a soldier and knight, I'm not sure if that's gonna be possible with these stats, but... Uh, Welcome to the town, hope you can have a great time here, man. So, let's continue with the tower of making it up. I want to have one at this side, and then want to move another one to this side. And uh, then we're also going to continue a path here that's most likely going to go all the way up to the mountain here. So I think that's going to be pretty cool. I think we can use the normal wall tool for this, going around again. So, do some in stone. Actually, let's go with that one. It has a little bit of more texture in it. Should make it look a little bit nicer. And I don't really think we need to make this higher than this for the moment. I think this would be a pretty good height for it. Then it can go up to the last floor that would be up here. So I'm gonna make another stair like in the middle. And we might use the stair tool perhaps for this. Not really gonna be too much room to walk in here, but the halflings only need one block to actually be able to walk, so it should be fine. We'll do something like that, and then we'll get up to the last floor of this. I do hear some big uh, stone golems, so we gotta go check it out. I'm pretty sure there's a stone golem somewhere, not too far away. I heard him somewhere, where is he? They are quite dangerous if you watch the latest episode, I think it was, when we fought one. Oh, there's a big Varanus horde here, I'm not really sure if we can handle them. Let's see if our troop has six soldiers. Did I, get, I think we got a second cleric in the end, yeah we did. But maybe we need better weapons, not sure how hard these guys will be in hard mode. We do get pretty good equipment, the weapon should also be pretty good. We got bone axe, we got bone maze, and then we have an iron pike, so we have pretty good footman weapons. Uh, the knight, however, do not have any like upgraded armory, and he has a basic bronze short sword, that's not super good really. We might need to get two knights, perhaps, for this town. And then we have our two clerics, of course, Aramai and Ranisman. And uh, Aramai is just the reason to promote it, so... Maybe we we'll go for maybe perhaps, perhaps Sir Bob can be another soldier. Maybe he could be a footman. We will make him to knight. His spirit maybe would be better if it was higher, but he uh, do have the body to be a soldier. So let's go for another soldier here. I don't think it's gonna be overkill. I'd rather have too many troops than having too few because we have too few, we can get screwed pretty much. And we also want to get in any near pretty soon as well, that's uh, really really helpful, those turrets, they deal a lot of damage, good amount. And we did find this iron vein in the latest episode, that was really awesome, that was really amazing to find that, good to good to find. So we're also going to do a thing like one of you guys said, to put a few of these um, iron bars and the ingots and stuff, to be maintained by our crafters, our blacksmiths, so we're just going to put a few of them. So I'm just gonna go for maybe 8 of each, and uh, the reason I'm doing that and not more is that I want to make sure we get all of them. Because this is gonna be a lot of work, we have 2 blacksmith for the moment, so it will be a little bit less. Iron we can go for 8, uh, steel we will go for less. That will go for like 5 perhaps. I guess we could put silver on, so once we can make it, we can make it directly, once we get the skill level for it. We need level 5 blacksmith for that. Golding got and put 5 for that one. And I would love to get this steel short, so hopefully we can get that one pretty soon, I hope so. If we do perhaps move the steel ingot up a bit, uh, then we can maybe make it a little bit faster. Can remove that one. Okay, so let's see, maybe we should go and attack someone. I saw some wolves down here. Oh, they're gone, I guess. Oh, there they are. Oh, are we getting attacked? Some battle music somewhere for something. Bring back my people. 
What is happening? Oh, they're fighting down here. Okay, so let's take the opportunity to go fight these guys. They had a bunch of kobolds uh, and also the Varanuses, so let's go and uh, take them out. I guess we maybe have to wait. Our knight, can you move faster, please? Or I didn't. Move on. Would love if they made the troops and actually walk together. Would be just fantastic if you actually did that, but uh, that's not how it works. So far, at least. Let's see if this is not going to be too big of a mistake. I think we go for the Varans, the big one first, maybe the small ones. Not really sure how dangerous this is going to be. We still need to fix the house so you can see through the trees, though, so hopefully they're going to do something about that, because it's it's really bad with this thing for the moment. Tobias, level 3 footman. Level 1 footman, awesome. Level 1 cleric. It's going really fast, these battles, like... It, a little bit later in the game, when they fight enemies, they can really level up so quick if they're newly promoted. Got a card level 4 Farmer, okay. Oh, level 3 Knight, awesome. Fortifies Stamina and Courage increased. So Bob is level 2. Okay, so I think we did pretty good here. Took the opportunity to go and fight them when we were busy with each other, pretty much. It was a good call, I would say. Tobias level 4 Fitman, awesome. Let's go take these wolves also, that's gonna be... Hopefully it will last for a little bit. It should be quite easy. Looks like we perhaps need maybe one or two more helmets also for our footmans. But we probably don't can keep that many normal footmans. But I guess we can make... it doesn't hurt to have it around. We can make at least two bronze helmets. So we get a little bit of a better one. And then we can do some bronze breastplate. Two more of those, and then also I'm gonna check out Weaver, who do not maintain any for, for the moment. I'm unsure if I put out the workshops. No, I haven't, so let's go and put them somewhere for now. Where do we want to put them though? So they will not be too much in the way. So I kind of want to have them down here, but it feels like it's a little bit limited. Maybe we can put them here for now. It's kind of weird position, but it should be working out just fine to have it here. And let's see with this one. We do have enough resources, so why are they not building that one? Because I don't think they have been building that one for a while. So we'll see if we have the instant builders or not. The game is able to handle all the things yet. But we probably need a little bit more wood to be able to continue with this. I'm just going to put the shop down a few trees, so we get that going. Six iron pipes, one giant bone maze. That could actually be worth it, to be honest, because uh, we can't craft this weapon, but at the same time, if we wait, we can actually... We can go and uh, get one of those two-handed swords, so I'm actually gonna wait with it. A panting refugee appear on the horizon. The wolves in woods, run away where they still can. Okay, we got more wolves. They're keeping me busy. I wanna build my tower. Damn you, game. Why are you keeping me busy? Where's this place? Here they are. Let's go fight these guys. Or do anything more. Yip yip bow! We saved them! The wolves are free, guys. So let's see what we got this time. We got a thick leather vest and some ingots, so that's not too bad. And I guess we can remove the walk thing. Not sure why it's still there. So let's see here. It looks like they have some kind of problem with going around here, and sometimes they just have to step in and perhaps add some kind of ladder. It should be able to go here, though. It should be able to go at this side also. Yeah, it shouldn't be a problem. These guys are climbing up just fine. So I don't really, really see the problem with this. So let's just instant build this, because the game doesn't want to handle the stuff. Here we go. The build is ready, it's done. Got a bit of food left over here, so let's go grab that one. Okay, let's see if we can do the tower now. So I want to be have another tower this side, so we gotta keep that in mind when we design this. I'm kinda gonna leave this side maybe maybe we can for now we can actually save this and copy it over because we got like the main parts done already but let's see if we can take this and perhaps put it like that and then we will pretty much just um, change where the door is 
then they should be kind of looking the same really. So we'll go down like this and then we'll put a double door in the middle. Then we're just going to make something between these two and then we might also do a doors between these. And it's going to be the best with a small door, so let's go for this one. One of each side. Uh, they look like they are not sitting the same actually, so let's uh, re remove this and put it out again. Okay, so now we got both of them, then we would need another door for this side. Like so, and then we want to connect these two to be the same structure, and we might be able to have some arches and whatever we want to have on this like bridge thing. We can even make it go something like that, and we can also, if we want, we can even expand this so it can go out further out, and I think two should be nice, like I said, oh, they only need one block to walk around, so this should be pretty safe, but um, I think maybe we should do it like a different color for it, or at least for the middle for it. Do something like that, and we need to have some of these. Here we got some support under this, that's going to be nice, and then we want to add maybe, maybe some, some extra things here. Something like that. But I was thinking that maybe like the roof uh, we do it different, so maybe this will actually be where they're shooting and they actually don't like really shoot from on top of here, so I'm thinking of actually doing it something like that and this will be the main shooting area and we're able to shoot at this side also, so perhaps we should expand this here as well. Can go all the way around I guess. Something like that, and now we're gonna do the roof that I think is gonna look pretty nice, guys. So then we got the starter roof. And I think that's gonna turn out pretty nice, and I might change a few things of how I kind of want to do it at the beginning. We will see how we do it. But uh, let's try with the idea I wanted from the beginning, we can see how that will turn out for us. So we can do the roof kind of like that, guys. I think that looks pretty nice. I'm just gonna add in some more details to this. I think something like that looks pretty nice. We might perhaps do something more up here. Maybe something like that, guys. Let's do the other roof. I think that is pretty good for roof, I think it's interesting and kind of maybe fits in with this roof and the other roofs. I kind of want to go for like a medieval Viking-ish theme for it, so a little bit of kind of Viking, a little bit of it, but with my very own touch of it. And I think I'm making some kind of like window holes up here, we're not really gonna add any window, because we don't have a window that really fits there, but I think it's gonna look pretty nice just to have some kind of hole here and that will give some light inside.
that's how we're gonna have that, and then we maybe wanna have some, like, windows on this. Here we go, that looks pretty good, I would say. But it feels like we need something more here, it just feels like something more. Maybe has some kind of, like, roof over the door? like that perhaps then maybe some lights that would be nice we could have yeah, some ticket torches up there i think that would be pretty cool so let's try that and we will see how that's gonna turn out how that's gonna look and i guess we can have it for the other side see so we're missing some blocks here that's how we're gonna have it there and then we can go for the ticket torch here and uh, i got double ones but then we also want to have Maybe some normal lantern somewhere. I think like kind of here we enter and we're maybe exit here. And I do think we can probably build this and then we can actually start to build other parts later on and we're gonna continue up here. I might change what we do but I think it would be a cool idea to continue the wall up here. But uh, yeah we'll see what happens with that. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this new tower the, that we made, the tower gate thingy. So I'm just gonna build it now. And guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave a like on the video. And also, if you wanna watch more, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching. Have a great day and take care, guys.